Hey guys, it's your girl Dazanaki coming back at you with another video. This time it is a Target haul or Target Ulta haul because I don't know about your Target, but my Target now has Ulta inside. So that's one less trip. Like, low key, I'm gonna like talk about where I live. I live like a rock throw away from the mall. So, and Target is inside of our mall. So, we got Target, you got the Ulta inside. Well, across the street from that is another strip mall that's got like Old Navy and Exporting Goods and Route 21 and Ulta. So they're both right here. Um, but I was at the mall and so I went to Target. So I got a Target haul, Target Ulta haul. Because who doesn't love Target and now there's Ulta inside? Like, way to step up the makeup department. As if it wasn't already stepping up. You done stepped it up. Um, so I'm just gonna pull all of these out and out, sweat inside the bag. I'm inside, fun inside, except it's not JCP. And it's wet in here, so. It's not particularly fun. Um, so let's start with that, the thing that made the bag wet. <laughs> this I've been using, uh, was it my shower? This is from Pacifica, as you can see. It was, well, as you can't see, because there's a clearance tag on top of it. Um, but I got this at clearance from Target. I got a lot of great finds. Target clearance, beauty, you always have to you always have to check, even if your Target hasn't converted yet, just like the backs of aisles, like not the main aisles, but like the back ends of like, like these end caps, always clearance, like clearance in the pet section, there's clearance in the beauty section always. I don't know, that's just what I've seen. Um, but this was a whole different section in the middle of the Ulta stuff. There's a whole little end cap of clearance and let me tell you, I got a lot of things there. This is from Pacifica. This is the Vegan Ceramide Extra Gentle Face Wash. It is also a makeup remover. Yes, I can confirm that, but it also says it on the back. It says to gentle, gently remove makeup, oil, and impurities with this light foaming sulfate free cleanser that won't strip your, your beautiful skin. <laughs> your blemishful skin. No, we don't want the blemishes. Um, so far, so good. I love it. Yeah. I was running out of my face, my makeup remover. So, yeah. This is another product that I've been using that I've already taken out. This is from Makeup Revolution, or yeah, Makeup Revolution. This is the Precise Brow Pencil. Bring it upside down. Yes, in the shade Medium Brown. It's got a spoolie on one end, very fine, um, retractable pencil on the other end. Very fun my brows. I've done it with my brows right now. Yeah, it's just great. I have no complaints there about a brow pencil. All right, jumping into something else, of course, you can never go wrong with needing some more eyeliner. So this is a product I got from NYX. It's called That's The Point Hella Fine Art Artistry Liner in the shade black, of course. Let's see if I can get this bad boy opened up. I've had some troubles. I love NYX products. We'll start with that part. I love NYX products. I love their eyeliners. I've had some troubles with one of their eyeliners, the like Epic liner. That's Epic or honey, it didn't want to come off. Oh my God, that's the cutest, finest little tip ever. So fine. So fine. Oh my gosh. Ooh wee. I mean, look how fine. I just did that little writing on there because the Super Bowl's tomorrow. Super Bowl's coming up, um, but wow. I mean, even the pencil itself is tiny. The pen, that's the point. Wow. I've never had an eyeliner, especially liquid, that was that skinny. Wow. All right. Is this? New? Yes, I did pick up a new. This is also over on NYX. I got a NYX lip pencil. This is in the shade Nude Beige. Because I don't have any brown lip liners. So there's that. And if you see the other bundle of things that I got on clearance that I'm saving until the end, of course, it's from one of my, it's one of my favorite formulas for a matte lipstick I'll give it much I'll give you that much and I found them on clearance for hella cheap but this lip liner would go perfectly with that 
So yes, I needed a refill on this. Let me figure out which side is English. <laughs> I need a refill in this. And of course, did I check my shade before I went? No, no, I did not. Did I get the right shade? No, no, I did not. I got a lighter one and that's okay too because it's a concealer, so that's all right. This is Maybelline's um, Instant, where's that the shiny part? The Instant Age Rewind Eraser Corrector, Multi-Use Corrector. Sometimes when I'm not using foundation I and I'm gonna use a lot of powder, I'll just use this on my face. And problem here is the bridge. Problem here is the bridge, yeah, 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 yeah. The good stuff, you know, because a little bit can go a long way with this too. Or you just use a lot more because it's buildable as well. Um, but this one is in the shade, it just says number 95. I can't remember what the box said on it. I have used this already. That's how I know that it's not the same shade. So, you know, this time, this next time when I went to Ulta, I wrote down exactly what I needed. That's that. Um, and the next product, I forgot. I got a couple more. I got this is my last NYX product. This is the NYX Hate the HD. It's the HD. This is the NYX HD Studio Photogenic Concealer in the shade 01. I've not tried this yet. Um, I say that I've not tried this one. I feel like I've tried this product before, but I'm not sure. I just want to try another concealer um, to help with my creasiness, but I also feel like that could be primer. And my moisturizer too, so um, I know I'm recording this video late. I know that, you guys don't know that. Um, but I've been to Ulta since I've recorded this video and I got a new primer that's supposed to help with that. So we'll see, we will see. Um, and then this one. This one is a dupe. I know it's a dupe, I'm gonna give you like a couple seconds to figure out who it's a dupe for. And all I can think of is a TikTok on my head like, a dupe. Gucci dupe. dupe. Ninja dupe. Okay, but check this out. The packaging alone. This is a mascara from Morphe. Who this look like? I'll give you a hint. It's normally pink. Doesn't this look like a, a, a Too Faced dupe? Yeah, this is Morphe's Mega Big Volumizing Mascara. The fact that they give you like all the same, they, it's, it's the box is set up the same. Like honey. Honey. This is just a sample one, but it's because I'm doing all right on mascaras, but you know, I can't help myself. Okay, first of all, there's a lot that just came out of there. It's a large to skinny to large. Crystals going on there. But I don't know why I just smelled it. Comes in that tube really nicely, but yeah, it's supposed to make it a hundred percent instant volume, a hundred percent experience immediate lengthening effect. And ninety-eight percent said the mascara was easy to build and layer. Prepare for big impact. I'm not denying that there will be big impact, but this packaging looks like somebody else. If we're about talking about a couple things that I've been using already, that's not one of them, of course. Um, I already said which ones I've been using already. I've been using this guy, and I've been using the whatever, the brow. I can't remember if I showed this before on my Shein haul, but I'm gonna show it again. This is from Shein Glam or She Glam or whatever the fudge they wanna call it. She Glam, She Glam. This is what I'm using on my inner corners. And like the white parts is a retractable white, bright white. I said my inner corners, but also like my under, my under eye. I can't, I don't know if it's still on there or not. But definitely my inner eye giving me the e-girl look that I want, loving it, loving it. It's the illuminating, let's see on here, there we go. The She Glam Fairy Wand Precision Highlighter Pencil. Bippity boppity, She Glam. Now, the moment you've been waiting for. 
I went ham. I went ham when I found these. And I was like, hello. I have what they call the lip whip. This one doesn't necessarily say it's called that, but I feel like it's the exact same thing. This is from Beauty Bakery. This is their matte lipstick. They call it their matte lip, yeah, matte liquid lipstick. This is Beauty Bakery's, they're bite size. So they are the mini ones. So I feel like these are normally like $10. Okay, um, Target wanted to sell them originally for $12, just for the mini size, the bite size. I got them for $360. Um, I got some for gifts, but I also need to figure out which one's my best nude shade. Um, I've already taken one out of the box. I got five. <laughs> I got five. Of course they don't the These are their names. And I was gonna swatch them in a TikTok, but um, I will do that still, but I'll swatch them here too. Um, so this first one I've already taken out is called For Real Dough. And I need to figure out which ones I like and which ones I'm gonna give to my best friend just because she has a dark complexion and these will make a lot more, they're just, they'll just work for her better than they work for me. Okay, so there's, ooh. Real dough. Then we've got I knew it. Because it's really hard to tell. They're in a frosted package. I'm sorry, I didn't even show you what it looked like. They're in a frosted package. The lip of one is like curved. It ain't still frosted. And it says lip of on the top. These are just say these ones don't have any embossing or any extra like that on there okay I knew it's definitely darker which I like this color but that would be a better one for her I'm going to show this to you guys like after and this one is brown sugar take nude it and I'd rather take brown sugar. This is truffle maker. Not to be confused with the trouble maker. But because it's beauty bakery so they're all bakery in inspired bakery themed. I wish they smelled like bakery, like baked goods. Ooh, she dark. I like that one better. I haven't done Christmas with my one best friend, Allie. Shout out to Allie, infinite, infinite beauties. Allie, I'll put her, I'll put her ass eye down here. She has a YouTube channel that she was starting on. But she has a much darker complexion than me, so a lot of these will suit her a lot better, which is why I was like, yes, I will buy all of these because I love them, and I love her. And this last one is Charalanid. Like a churro. I tried to roll my R's there. Because it is Hispanic. I realize I didn't describe any of these colors, but it was hard to, I mean, it's hard to describe them. I don't know how many are in this collection, but these are the five that I got. And they're beautiful. And yeah, now I'm gonna sit here and share them and figure out which ones I wanna keep and which ones I'm gonna give to my best friend. So thank you guys so much for watching my Target haul and check out either my Instagram reels or TikTok to see about these nails, all right? Or you learn a little bit about them in my next Ulta haul. So stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope that you have a fabulous weekend, just a fabulous week, a fabulous month, a fabulous life. All right? Be fabulous. 
Look fabulous. That's the first step. Look fabulous. Get fabulous. Be fabulous. If you're not, if you don't wake up and be fabulous, do those steps. If you're not already fabulous, otherwise, do those steps. Be fabulous. You catch a drift. Thank you so much for watching. Two Face Do.